zoning position and, and um, see if you know the qualifications that you bring you line up with that. Okay, so um, my question is, is uh, about the in-person meeting, maybe the three, or uh, possibly because, you know, giving over that information through an on online portal, that's fine. Um, however, there hasn't been much communication or any progression with this application process. I mean, of course, I can just fax it over, fax over my personal information, but at this time, because I've been continuously running in circles, um, I would like to, you know, sit down and, and handle mm -hmm. that in person. Mm -hmm. Is that a possibility? Having quorum, no, unless it's in a public meeting. So if you wanted to interview with two trustees, it has to be in a public meeting. Now, they voted through an administrator tonight. The only way you could do that is either meet with us individually or if you want a second person in there, we've got an administrator. Once that person is up and running, they can conduct the interview as well. Okay, so what about this suggestion? She gives us a her application, and we look at it, and we decide to uh, have an interview at the next meeting in the executive session. Is that doable? Well, that's fun, and that's proper. Well, we didn't interview anybody else you guys hired tonight, so. So I, I agree. I think that um, <clears throat> if you don't feel comfortable faxing and you want to bring your application up here, um, Trustee McGuire is over zoning. And so um, if you complete the app, you can pull the application offline, fill it out, bring in your resume, you can call up her and, and, and schedule an appointment with Trustee McGuire and, um, Hopefully he can sit down with you and go over some things. <clears throat> and then you guys can decide how you want to go further. Okay, and would I be able to bring somebody in attendance to that um, scheduled meeting on my end? Or how does that work? Because you, I think it was already mentioned that it's not all three of you would be able to be on right. a second person. So on my end, I'll have somebody there um, as well. Is, are, are we okay with that? So I'm not really sure. So you you mean you want to bring somebody to your interview? I don't want to have a one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, okay. 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 I want to make sure that I have somebody else okay. present whenever that, I'm speaking to anybody on the board of trustees. Okay, that's that that's fair. Yes. Um, and and perhaps we have um a, a fiscal officer or um somebody else that might be able to do that. Um, and I don't know maybe he. Is okay with you bringing somebody else? So trust okay. me, or you can take care of that. Okay. Is that when you're okay with it, or what do we say? Uh, after the comments that she made, I think I need to talk with Weevil. So. Um, excuse me, sir, what comments did I make that you that would then push you towards legal instead of uh, making progression of the situation? Well, it's my prerogative. Sorry. Okay. Um, what does your calendar look like uh, in the month of June uh, so that way we can sit down with legal? This is a meeting for me to have, not okay. for you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, so, so all of us are I guess over, until we get your application, are. once we receive your application, at that point, we'll proceed from there. To have me on tape and record for all this until we see your application, we don't even know if you've got the qualifications to even. Mr. Sit down. McGuire, is it fair to say that you have not um, had any engagement and conversation to even see what my what I have? We well, haven't applied, so I don't know. Right. So, <laughs> sir, you're trying to force the hand. No, excuse me, sir. It's been difficult to get in contact with you. So how do I? I think I talked with you for over an hour. Oh, when was this? I can go back and look, but I know we spent a lot of time on the phone. Sure. So. And what was that discussion consist of? You were laying out the process.
project. Okay. You Which project said project are we you said your intentions because you have the Radcliffe School, okay. correct? Or is it the same person I talked to? Is that what the same page? Do I have the Radcliffe School? What do you mean by you? You were Radcliffe? part of the. You bought the school. Oh, I. I your bought group. The school? Okay. Yes or no? That's the, I'll hold that that confidential at this time. So, uh, what else was the discussion about? Well, that was, I think you asked about, uh, you asked about township support. So you wanted township resources to come in and help clean up. I told you that it's not entirely my decision because it involves a domain that Mr. McLaughlin has with staff and dump trucks. Okay. So there was some logistical issues. I think the conversation was positive. But uh, the way that you've represented in that meeting, I don't think that's entirely accurate. But that's, you've got your, you've made your point on the record. Okay, so um, yes, I did speak to you. I spoke to you early January about a potential cleanup happening over there at that school, absolutely. Um, and you did make some, uh, some uh, you know, recommendations of some of the things that you said that the township could help with. And uh, when we're talking about resources, we're talking about, um, you know, logistics, right? Uh, we did not talk about funding or any kind of money involvement. Um, so I do want to just make sure that we are all aware of that. Um, you did discuss that uh, the township has, possibly does have some dump trucks um, available um, that you would be willing to look into and that you would get back to me about that. And then we also did discuss um, working with the sheriffs uh, to have um, to have access to inmate workers coming to the property for, for, the, for uh, you know, workforce development. And so, yes, sir, we did speak about that. Uh, you did say that you would follow up with me, and I've never, I've never heard anything back from you up until today. But right you now. also were, I think you were, we talked about funding because this project is kind of in the beginning stages. It's going to take a lot of money. So I know we talked about that. Oh, no, sir. We did not talk about that. <clears throat> no, sir. So. We already know. We, we know Jefferson Township. We know you don't, you don't have any money to give up. Trustee and member of the board, I'm going to throw something out there and um, whatever you guys' opinions, if they are, and whatever said, but um, I, I'm kind of wondering maybe if the application for we got off the zoning job, but for the zoning job and the application to be given, um, the hiring process that we've used since the first year with this new leadership, the applications have gone to the trustee back. And I know that Trustee McGuire is over the zoning, but uh, there seems to be some kind of confrontation and a little bit of um, uh, issues there. So I don't know if maybe just for the uh, generalization of it, if Trustee's back is okay to accept the application, maybe better that if um, it went through that process first. Um, and then trustee back and go over and decide if it's a good pick, give it to the two trustees and we can do, proceed forward in having a, uh, decide if we want to do a one-on-one -on -one interview, how we want to do the interview process, if we want to do an executive session in the next meeting, or what we want to do there. But I'm just throwing it out there that maybe the application needs to go to trustee back instead of trustee requirement. I don't know about that. So would you please do that then when you, if and when you decide, if you haven't changed your mind and you want to try to help the township out and uh, show us what you have and what you can do for us, uh, please give that paperwork and application to a uh, trustee back. Okay. And if we could schedule something so I can yes. physically drop it off. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Anything else? No, sir. Motion. 
motion to adjourn. We are now good. We are now uh, adjourned at uh, eight fifty one.